answering the call from a new era. It's the gorgeous Disgrace. And today, we are going to be looking at Mini Choi from Rainbow High Rainbow Vision The Royal 3. This doll is beautiful, but you had, like, no screen time. Like, I'm pretty sure she didn't say anything in the whole show. She didn't say a single word. Yeah. We do have other doll videos that need to be done, but I just really wanted to get out of the box today. Yes, as you can see, it says Rainbow High, Rainbow Vision, some music notes, Mini Choi, Let Your True Colors Shine, her second outfit, her cake, her... K-pop merch, your second shoes, everyone else is at the bottom here. She's a music focus, even though she's from a different school altogether. It says RH Royal 3 at the semi-finalist right there. Yeah. Um, Korean character, Rainbow High Rainbow Vision. The world famous Rainbow Vision music competition is heating up and the girls of Royal 3 have their eyes on the prize. Well, they won. The Royal 3 won, so, yeah. Did I talk about everything in the box? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Now I'm going to get her out of the box, and we'll be right back. So I am back with Mini Choi out of the box. I didn't take out any of her accessories yet. I was just like, let's look at the doll first. Here's her beautiful pink hair. There is a little bit of product, but it's just like over here. Like, there's just product here. Okay, there's a little bit of product on this side. Never mind. The rooting looks really nice. I like her hair, but I wish her twin tails were a little higher. So maybe I'll just... Maybe I'll restyle that. But I don't want to mess up her braids, you know? Like, I wish they were more higher. Whoa, there is a lot of product there. I think the product is mostly in the twin tails. Let's... No... No. But I do love her hairstyle, mostly because I love twin tails. They're what I wear to work. We have her headset, which isn't pegged into her ears. I wish, like, they had done that for all of them and not just Tiara song. Her headset, the mic piece is a little heart. That's cute. She has some nice brown straight eyebrows. Her makeup is pink with some white. She has some beautiful lashes. And she has a little heart on the side of her face here. Eyes follow you. That's something I've been noticing a lot recently with Rainbow High Dolls is that their eyes follow you. Because I remember the first one I got where the eyes followed me, it was Daphne Minton. And as much as I love her, that freaked me out. So maybe it's just the uh, eye sculpt. Yeah. Also, I absolutely love this outfit. This is so adorable. Like This outfit is super cute. That yeah, we have this. Uh, pink tank top here, which has like some pearls. So it's supposed to be pearls. Some of these, they're laid on top of it. Same with on the jacket. Some pearls, or whatever they're supposed to be. Then some tassels. And I absolutely love her skirt. This skirt is so adorable. We got a zipper detail. We got, we got a bunch of zipper details on the skirt. Is it, long, is it double lined? Like, I don't know. But like, there's this part and then there's the part between it and now her fabric boots. These boots are killing it. I just want, just to do a little zoom in on her makeup. Yeah, these boots are killing it. They say RR, I wish they said SS on the back. Oh, wait, no, on the side here, there's some, like, little more plastic details. His boots are very detailed. Oh, and then there's some more on the bottom here. Love that for you. Then here's her stand. It's a really pretty, it's like a pink color, but it has, like, some darker glitter inside of it. Kind of giving rose gold. And then here is her comb, just, you know, the traditional rainbow high comb. I think I literally have like four just sitting here looking at me. Oh, her rooting too. Her rooting is actually really good. Like, I don't feel any bald spots. It feels very full. Oh, never mind. 
I pull, I separate it a bit, and it's a little, and there's some bald spots back there, but for the most part, it's pretty good. Now, before we get into her second outfit and her K-pop merch, I'm gonna go wash her hair, and we'll be right back. Okay, so I am back with Minnie in her second outfit. Weird thing is, I already filmed this a while back, but when I was editing, my TV was on. I think I had a friend over or something and they were watching something, but I was like, I need to quickly finish filming this. I don't know what was happening. So yeah. Now I feel like I can talk about Minnie Choi's outfit in so much more detail. Like, look at how stunning this is. I'm getting Miraculous Ladybug vibes from it. Also, I just finished watching all of Miraculous Ladybug. Yeah, we got her outfit. There's, it doesn't, nothing continues on to the back except for the arms. Yeah, nothing on the back except for the trim and whatnot. That's about the only thing that comes to the back. But when you hair this long, do you really need to show the back? <laughs> yes, we got all these details here. This light pink color mixed with black. Because, you know, black pink in your area. Alexa, play black pink. Oh. Black pink. Alexa, black pink. off. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> I can't do that while I'm filming. I do love black. I, I just love how her colors. I wish she had some black streaks in her hair. Because, like, that's her main color. is black and pink. It's just so ornate. So beautiful. We got lace down here. We got lace at the end of the sleeves. A little zoom in on the manicure. So you can get that manicure. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, slay, slay, slay your enemies. And then she's got a pair of pink socks here. We also have some extra hair here. Pink, mm, I wouldn't call, I don't know what to call that length. It's kind of an awkward length for socks, really. But her shoes here, oh, these shoes are beautiful. I love the strappy design, the flowers all over the heels. Flora from Wings Club would absolutely wear these shoes. Like, look at them. They're stunning. They're beautiful. She also did come with a pair of black gloves, but I'll show you who I put them on. So for the black gloves she came with, I put them on Tessa Park. Because I felt like they went with her aesthetic better. Oh, I love it. I love Tessa Park. Definitely, definitely my favorite from the Royal Three even though this is a mini video. Right there where Tiara's song is, that's where I keep all three of them. It's like a stage, but not a stage, but a stage. So there they are. Minnie's not there at the moment, mostly cause, I mean, she, she didn't get any lines. She only sang in the whole series. There's everything from her second outfit. I will be putting her back in her first outfit because it is the preferred look. I kind of want to put her hair into two high ponytails, two, into two high twin tails, though. But I feel like I have too many dolls with that. There's Emmy, but then I have, oh no, there's Emmy, there's Holly, there's Stella, there's Natasha. Her video just came out before I will post this one, so go and watch go and watch Natasha's video. Is that everything? Yeah. But yeah, we were gonna talk about her booklet. So the difference is that she's in the center and then everyone is around her. The names are on the back, but hers are in hers is on a pink backdrop. So the first page first page is exactly the same. Nothing different, nothing new, same old shit. <laughs> I've been watching this YouTuber called The Unicorn of War way too much. And they use like memes and whatnot in their videos. So I like will quote their stuff all the time. But here is the second picture. We got a cute close up of Minnie here. Then we have a full body shoot. And then we have a full body shot on her second look. But then everything else is exactly the same. The lyrics to Spotlight. More lyrics. And then the this one is the, the shirt that came with Tessa Park, who... I don't have it on any of them. Like, Sunny, I have in the one Tiara came with. 
for the one Tessa came with, I have her. I have Leela in it. I almost forgot her name. So I have Leela in the top that she came with. I kind of want to put her in the other one because I'm Sunny and, you know, I mean, I do ship her on Sunny. So, hey. Lunny. Lunny. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's okay. So... I forgot to film the articulation of Miss Minnie Choi. It is the same as every other Rainbow High Doll, but I just love talking about doll articulation. So, yeah. The head can move around. You got, it can go like that, like that. Not really side to side as much, but it's still pretty good. Why is your hair getting in the way? The arm can lift up. You got a movement at the elbow. It can also swivel around. The wrist. Yeah, the wrist can move around. Doo -doo -doo. The leg can kick up about that high. Kick back about that much. We have the joint up here, which is full 360. Move her leg all the way around. And then we got one, two, a double joint in the knee. So the knee can go back and her knee can bend back about that far. No ankle articulation, no joist, jo no chest articulation. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, okay. So that's been Mini Choi's articulation. Even though it's not a Leela video, Leela is one of my absolute faves. <laughs> but I should have Mini standing over here too. Okay. Yeah. So yes. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave me a like, a beautifully written comment. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. I don't know when I will post another video. I haven't gotten any dolls, any new dolls recently. What is your earring doing, girl? I haven't gotten any new dolls recently, so who knows? But yes, I hope you enjoy the content I have. And thanks for coming. Bye!